to the full saving of Windows 10 series. This is Zia Maliki from Information Technology. You are watching the 8th part of the full training of Windows 10 series. In the previous video, I showed you how to use multiple desktops to keep things nice and tidy for ourselves. In today's tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to use the snap feature in Windows 10. It is very normal to open multiple windows on a single desktop. Let me open a few programs such as Word, Excel, File Explorer and Calculator running at the same time. All of them on one desktop. So we have multiple windows running on the same desktop and I'm going to show you how to use the new feature of Windows 10 that's called Windows Snap which has been upgraded and enhanced to make it even more useful when you are working with several windows or applications at the same time. If you are wondering what Windows Snap is, then let me explain it for you. It's more useful when we have larger monitors. We take one application to the one side of the screen and size it to make space for another program and put another windows on the other side of the screen so we can look at two programs at the same time when we are making comparison and assessment. This feature is mostly used by the translators or transcribers. They use this feature to have the original file opened on one side of the screen and open another file and translate or transcribe on the other side of the screen. So now we have Word in Excel on the right and left side of the screen. Let me just put them back to how they work and use the snap feature which will make it even more easier for us. We already know from the previous tutorials that we can move a program or a windows by grabbing it from the title bar. We can drag it up or down, right or left. But if we grab a windows from the title bar and drag it all the way to the left side of the screen or all the way to the right side of the screen, which I'm doing right now, as soon as my mouse hit the right edge of the screen, it will snap and fill the screen with the Word program or any other program we intend to do. When we snap a program to the right side of the windows, then we can snap another program to the left side of the screen. Now it's showing the remaining programs to me, which allows me to snap one of them to the left side of the screen. For example, I want to snap the Excel program. As I click on the Excel, it will sit to the left side of the Word program. Now the programs are sitting side by side. Let me do it one more time. I will drag the Word program back down and I will drag Excel back down. Now I want to snap 
Microsoft Excel to the right side of the screen and Word to the left side of the screen. So I will grab Excel this time and drag it to the right side of the screen. As my mouse hit the right edge of the windows, I will let go and it snaps to the right side of the screen. It shows me the other windows on the left side. I want Word on the left side. I will left click on the Word program and it will snap into the left side. And to take it out of the snap mode, I will drag it back down and it will come to its normal mode again. I will drag the program to the left or to the right. And if I don't want to snap another windows, I will just click on the blank area and they will go to where they were before. In summary, the window snap is an excellent feature that has been enhanced recently which allows us to snap another windows beside each other. That would be it for today's tutorial. Now take a moment and practice what you have learned in this tutorial and come back as I will be showing you more cool features of Windows 10 as we dive further and further into learning Windows 10. So stay tuned and it's goodbye for now.